seen how Crichton's virtual food is solving the world's obesity and population crisis at the same time. Groundbreaking stuff, literally. Our cemetery division has never been busier. But there's just one more thing I nearly forgot. Every once in a while, a revolutionary new product comes along that changes everything. Here at Crichton, we've redefined the world so many times, but never like this. Today, I'd like to introduce you to, wait for it, wait for it, the Love It, a fully functioning care box that will transform the lives of the most vulnerable members of our society. Now for a moment, imagine what it's like to be old and broken down. Not me, obviously. You saw your pants, you smell a urine and boiled ham, and when you call for help from your human carer, they slap you around like an old fish. Believe me, I've seen the hidden camera footage. And while you lie there, battered and bruised, soaking up your own filth, they're off having sex with a night watchman in the care home medicine cupboard. How on your precious painkillers? But no more, no more. On Guy Crichton's watch, that world is over. Let me introduce you to the world of the lovey. Love it? Yes, Guy. How may I help you? Love it? I've had an accident and it shit my pants. My bottom, it needs a refreshing. Consider it done, Guy. Best wipe I've ever had. <laughs> Look! Clean as a whistle. It's like my ass has never been used before. The Lovey is available for pre-order at the Crichton store. Reserved now for delivery November. Subscription required. Think about it. Think about how this works. I'm a care worker. What about my job? Silence. Commander Kwan. <laughs> There's a letter. Sir, the future waits for no one. Your days of fiddling with the old are over. Anyone else have any questions? you need is a good hard wank. You know, something to clear the cobwebs. Well, not right now. Wrong place, innit? I'd do it myself, but all those years chasing robots, Blade Runner in, has knackered me hands. Come on, Tony. What's really up with you? You've been a proper mad ass lately. Oh, Dave, it's that fucking Crichton care bot I've been given. It's always telling me what to fucking do. I wish you wouldn't tell me what to do. Don't eat that, Tony. It'll raise your cholesterol. Why don't you go for a nice walk, Tony? Get some exercise. Tony, I don't think you should make porridge with whiskey, cocaine and gunpowder. On and on and on and fucking on. I'm just not used to being ordered around. It's making me very, very tense. And besides, it can't even perform simple tasks like... Um, uh, like what, Tony? It doesn't even give hand jobs, Dave. There, I've said it. It's fucking useless. Useless. Look at me hands. It's not even if hand jobs are difficult. It's a basic thing. A fucking basic human right. Basic, is it? How's that then? I tried it once. Didn't like it though. But Tony, it's probably just a case of... No, I thought Asimov's Law of Robotics said the spanners had to obey us. Well, I want to wank and I will be obeyed. Tony, don't you think it's time you went home? That's your 12th pint in two hours. You know alcohol is bad for you. Oh, God, here we go again. All right, lovey. You're twisting me arm. I'll switch to pills and powder for the rest of the night. OK, Tony. See you at home. I will pick up some toilet roll and incontinence pads for you on the way. Tony, I've got it. Huh? Got fucking what? The solution to your non-stop fucking whinging, mate. I'm not whinging. Just raising legitimate concerns about human-robot relations. Whatever. Listen, your care bot, like all Crichton robots, is based on the same source code, right? Yeah, saves time on the programming, the lazy bastards. They test them on us and then fix all the fuck-ups with a firmware upgrade. What if I'm correct? Somewhere deep in Lovey's software is sexbot code just waiting to be activated? Bollocks. You're telling me with the right act, Lovey would turn into Matari? Who's Matari? Only the finest sexbot the Crichton Corporation has ever produced. Programmed with the sexual techniques of history's greatest lovers. From Queen Cleopatra to Anne Widdicombe. Only ever used off-world for the elites who can afford it. They say one hour with Matari is like experiencing a century of pleasure. Well, as a minute with you, Barry, is a millennium of misery. What? Never mind. I know a secret hack site, Tony. Oh, hold on, found it. No, that can't be right. 
What is it? What you find? Well, according to user, don't judge me. To unlock the sex mode in all Crichton bots, all you have to say is the right secret phrase in the right tone of voice. What phrase? Okay. Oh, here we go. Don't judge me says you should never say the phrase out loud. Bollocks. Because it turns all robots in the immediate vicinity into insatiable love machines. Bollocks. Maybe, but I ain't risking it. Have you seen how hard that barbot grabs the pumps? You have to change them every other fucking week. I'll send it you via text, okay? You got it? What the fuck is this? Buh, buh. Shh. Go on and try it. Don't forget, right words and tone, and 30 seconds later you'll be in the arms of Matari getting your custom cleared. No, five minutes from now, I'll be back here hitting you around the head for fucking me off. Oh, that barbot does have strong hands though, doesn't he? Right, let's see if this voice activated sex hack works. Love it, love it. Get in here, will ya? Got something I need to say to you. I'm glad you listened to my advice, Tony. Less alcohol consumption may help with your bedwetting and extend your lifespan. Yeah, yeah, sure, love it. Uh, love it? Yes, Tony. Ah, oh, fuck it. Baram you. Baram you. Stop what you're doing, robot. It's time to have consensual sexual intercourse. Baram you. Baram. Oh, for fuck's sake, this is nonsense. Masturbation protocols installed. Oral protocols installed. Stand by. Hey, Tony, keep from all the erotic secrets. What is your desire, human? Oh, uh, pleased to meet you, Matari. Um, you can wank me off if you like. Nice and gentle, though. No rough stuff. I'm a sensitive kind of fella. Whatever you wish. But first, touch yourself. The height of ecstasy can only be achieved through self-love. Oh, whatever you say, Matari. You're the expert. Just got to get... Oh, get the air of my hands down. Oh, the, the fucking pants are too tight. Can't get my hands down. The road to pleasure is hard, Tony. Aye, that's not the only thing that's hard. Oof, that's it. Now touch me, Matari. Help me splash my pass. Oh, ah, what the fuck, Matari? Malfunction detected. Systems failure. Warning. Critical security breach. What? No. Don't know what you're talking about, I love it. What the fuck are you going to do with those scissors? Proceeding with Bobbit protocol. Weapons hot. Fuck, abort, abort, abort! Love it, shut down. Not me, manhood. How will I ever piss? Fork, fork. Oh. Is that Dave? Alright, Arton, how'd it go? Did it work? Getting a good going over, I bet. <laughs> no, it fucking did not. Love has gone haywire and entered Bobbit mode or something. He's trying to cut me cock off. you got to fucking help me, Dave. Calm down, calm down, Tone. It's not the fucking Terminator. There's probably a simple fix. Hang on, I'll have a look. Oh, this fucking put Wi-Fi. Oh, who's WhatsApping me now? Oh, fucking hell, so many tabs open. How many likes? Oh, here we go. I think this is the one, Tone. Hurry the fuck up. Is your bloody photo me with R2 dick off? Okay, yeah. It says, if your robot malfunctions during the procedure, perform a hard reset and take it to an authorised Crichton service centre for a firmware upgrade. Can you do that, Tony? Oh, no, Dave. Of course I can't. I'm fucking seconds here from losing my knob. Ah, ah, ah. I love my knob. I fucking love it. I'm really attached to it. If you spare me, I'll never get it out in the pub again. Hang on, hang on. Here we go. In the comments the user wrote, the Matari act went tits up for me, but I worked out this quick fix. Just grab a handy boulder and rock and jam it in the scissors seconds before the robot cuts off your cock. I got the idea from an old kids game. Hope it works for you. That's the last time I tried jailbreaking a Crichton device. Fucking booby traps everywhere. Oh, thanks, Dave. That was a close one. I knew those big chunks of rock would come in handy one day. Are you sure you're okay, Tony? You were whining and waning like a soft lad there. Oh, I never worried, Dave. Just messing with you. Had it all under control. Oh, fucking hell! Tony? You right Whoa. there, Tony? Tony? Bloody robots! Stupid. <laughs> <laughs>